Le net seniors and colleagues, who would you say hello now? Hello. Now, wow, we are live in Iba. Okay, hello. <laughs> so, <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. So, we are in Iba community. Came to bury a colleague. Make sure I pronounce our and name properly. About to leave. I'm not calling your name now. Okay, call their names. <laughs> it's Iba now. Iba or Iba. Iba. Sorry, no verse. Say hello to the blog. Hello. 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 <laughs> they tell you something, they talk about that thing. Oh, oh really? it's not nice. This is not nice. Live from Iba community, River State. Yes. 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 So we're about to leave. Um, there are lots of lawyers here, but we're leaving because they are done. I want to get ahead of traffic. So I'll see you guys later. Okay, bye. Don't <laughs> <Benton> lose. <laughs> <laughs> Not be this person. Another banga. Make a call, make a bong, bong, bong. Make a call, make a key, but the bong, bong, bong. Your body, the car, make a bong, bong, bong. On a man, get it. So you don't go sell. So you don't go sell. I'm waiting to tell me. Just me buckle. What's your secret? Huh? I'm with Jasmine. This is supposed to be our own shopping time. I know I look a bit, I'm tired. I fell. Yes. Okay, that was a bakery. So yesterday at the, as we're leaving, as we're going to the barrier, when we got to the place, I fell. I'll show you guys the wound. Um, I really hurt myself. And so just all the plans I had to dish are fizzled out. I cooked rice and beans with stew, palm oil stew. And yeah, the Lily just did not running temperature. So right now, I'm quickly gonna go get food and um, get the plantain. And um, I bought unripe plantain, but she wants ripe plantain, so I'm gonna get that now. I just keep the unripe at home. I was able to get it for seven thousand. I was trying to bargain six five, but the woman didn't budge. So <laughs> it looks like the plantain is not even affordable anymore. But at least for that big bunch, I think it's worth it. It's worth the seven thousand, but I feel like if I go to a bigger market, I can get for like six thousand, five thousand. But this particular woman brings from her farm in the village, so um, I'm always sort of um, calm, knowing that it's not covered. You know this carpet that they put inside, um, carpet that they put in, in plants and vegetables for it to get right back, right quickly, and fruits and stuff, so it's not covered. Anyway, I'm heading to the market and let me see if I can get ripe plantain. Yeah, your old school is in front, not here. I can get ripe plantain, yam, sweet potato. So that tomorrow, being Sunday, I'm able to, um, you know, cook. I wanted to do, I wanted to edit, but I'm still not in the mood to edit or do anything. But I'm going to try. <clears throat> I'm going to try. Anyway. Anyway, I even have a lot of things to buy. Mom is here. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, where? I said here. Okay, you're snapping your fingers. Okay. So, I'll see you guys. <laughs> Sorry, this, this part I'm a bit lethargic. It's not my fault. I'm tired. Okay? I'll see you guys later. Let me go get. I even eat meat. I'm not going to buy it today. Let me rest. Let me say bye.
Oh, I've seen red plantain. Thank God. That's very okay. Oh, me afternoon, no. I beg, I need red plantain. The one way soft, though, you get. Okay. The yam. Make I see the yam where you get. Yam. Eh. May I see. In the middle of the road, there's no way to park. This plant away there like this, it's soft, so I don't body where it ripe, now inside, no ripe. So don't know, now two way no ever soft inside it. How much is one? Two thousand. Look, one, one thousand, now madam. No, no, look at this size, I'm not showing sure you size of plant, but you know. What's it, don't have a plant, they don't okay. be one thousand with the bell like this. No, anywhere where you see five or six. I won't buy a bunch of plantains, 7,000. Uh -huh. They want this one come in like this now. So, how, how, how many pieces? It's big. For this one. And they take just now for that junction there. I'm going to the yam. May yeah. I see the yam? Did you say good afternoon? Why do you say I'm there like this now? Japanese, you cannot carry oh. it. Bring another one. Two thousand naira worth of plantain. <laughs> this one, five. Meanwhile, the bunch, the whole bunch is seven thousand. Because I need ripe plantain. This is the real. This one, how much? Three thousand. Why now? I'm gonna come out some more money. Only two five. Maybe two seven. Two five. Now uh, uh, nah, maybe old customer now, nah, not be today. Because it's too heavy. I buy this here two four by twenty-four. No, no. Give me two six. Two, I used to do Madam, two five, I beg. I beg. Make you try help me now. Nah. Here. Yeah. Give me another one. Give me two. Bah. That's what they be. She's coming, Jasmine. She's coming. She's not there. Here, yes, good afternoon. Give me 20,000. All right. Hello, how are you? Did you say good afternoon, Jasmine? Good afternoon. How has been the holiday? I know you trust you don't stress me. 5,000, 7,000. No, 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 no. 7,500. See, I don't go do. Can you count it? Count it. Count it. Count how many? Count it. 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 Count Plastic bag, nylon, but some people call it leather. Let's remove your hand from the window, please. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thank you. Thank you. So, yeah, five, five thousand. Plantain, seven thousand, eight thousand. Seven thousand, okay, eight thousand. Thank you very much. Put the plantain. No, when we are coming down, we we'll put the plantain Thank inside. You. Thank you. Sorry, ma. Thank you. So key, all of them don't be notice. I'm not joking. No my guys, them them know me. Since oh six, I've been writing this story. I know the OG, but if you ask them, them know me. I know they blow trees, so you know me. Just notice and no peace I tell you 
Thank you. <laughs> hey fam so we're rounding up this vlog um even though i feel like this vlog is a bit scanty but um it's not all vlogs that have like cooking and it's not all vlogs that have activity activity this is just like a chill um i mean a few days in my life right um Lilian was sick i don't know if i mentioned in the vlog already she had like a stomach bug my mind was all over the place i feel like sometimes you don't realize um what motherhood is like to your children are in crisis and it kind of made me think about god how god feels when we get ourselves into trouble or we you know the devil attacks or something happens to us like the way i felt it just kept making me feel like i imagine how god, how god feels when he just wants to take care of us wants to help us out of situations so yeah but lily jane is fine now the fever is down she's no more studying she's no more throwing up she's okay and yeah i just want to end this vlog i'm supposed to be getting ready for a baby dedication right now oh boy did you see that mosquito <laughs> i'm supposed to get ready for a baby dedication right now the weather is hot so i'm contemplating whether i should wear makeup or not but i know i would regret it because it's like of course a baby dedication they are coming back from church so everybody's going to be in full glam i don't i don't like looking dressed down you get what i mean Depends so yeah, um, I just wanted to mention something before I end this vlog. I'm a lawyer, of course, so there are a lot of things that be happening, happening in the legal sphere, popular legal sphere, and I'll do a dedicated video about this. But I've talked about defamation, libel, and slander a lot of times, okay? I feel like maybe two or three times I've done videos on it and people still don't get it, that your opinion is not just your opinion, okay? We think it's just the internet, we think it's just reaction videos, we think it's just saying things anyhow that, okay, there are celebrities or people in the public eye so you can say anything you like. Now, you cannot, okay? There's freedom of speech but there's consequences for freedom of speech, okay? The constitution guarantees freedom of speech but once you open your mouth and say something, there are consequences depending on whether the person wants to show or not. So, we all know the general gist of somebody claiming that Messi Chin was baby, they just revealed their baby maybe like a week or two ago looks like um, Nathan Abassi allegedly and Nathan Abassi has petitioned the police to investigate and then Mercy Chin and her husband have filed a civil suit so there's criminal defamation, there's civil defamation and there are so many other things involved I'll talk about it in depth in a video coming soon um, while when I get the papers I want to actually see the actual petition and see Mercy Chin was on as well so that we can dissect it as much as possible but the truth is that please we have to be careful okay and I like that Nigerian celebrities I like their Especially that they are Christians because a lot of people say, oh, Christians should let it go. It's not that deep. It's not that this. It's not that. Please, it's that deep, okay? It's that deep. We should stop taking Christians for granted. We should stop taking people that don't say anything for granted. You cannot just from nowhere demand DNA tests. Like, what are you implying, okay? What are, what kind of injury do you want to cause? The same thing they did to Mobad's wife. I really didn't talk about Mobad's situation because... Honestly, I just felt some kind of way about it. The young guy that just, I mean, he didn't deserve to die the way he did, okay? And so I never really brought it up in my channel. But the same thing they did, people that came from nowhere demanding DNA tests. Oh, it's not this, it's not, who are you? Who are you to say the things that you think you can say? Anyway, that's not the point. The point is that my subscribers, my followers, um, other people that come across this video, please. It's not just the internet. Be careful what you say. And even the repercussions of what you say, even if they don't sue somebody, okay? Even if you don't get sued for defamation or you don't get petitioned or anything like that, think about the fact that you're using somebody's government name. Like me, for instance, my YouTube name is Sutoin. There's some people that their names are Nelo Keiko, for instance. Um, all these people that have their full names on, the, on their YouTube pages or their social media pages, when you drag them, when you troll them, when you say things that you cannot back up, you cannot guarantee, say things that might injure their reputation, especially in the public eye be careful that you're using their government name somebody can just try to google somebody and all they are seeing is reaction videos all they are seeing is videos on instagram trolling them saying things like that i beg i beg we are hurting people's reputation people's potential to earn people's potential to get jobs even visa these days visa people are asking for visa applications asking for your social media handle and stuff they want to see 
okay they want to see what you're about or what you're saying or whatever imagine if you google somebody a visa player and you see did, 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 did. I, I mean we don't know the extent of what we are doing and how far reaching it is so please i'm begging be careful anyway i hope you enjoyed this vlog um i'm glad my kids are feeling better let me get ready for the dedication they're about to come into the room jasmine what is it i'm waiting for daddy to come back before i dress up Okay, I'll go and stay with your sister, alright? Tell Miss Esther to use wipes and clean the white part of your shoes. Okay, see, it's dirty. She tell, tell her to use wipes, then shut the door, alright? I'll see you soon. Bye. Alright guys, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up, like this video, subscribe. Thumbs up and like are the same thing. Subscribe, turn on the noti notification bell. I think I'll show you my outfit when I get ready. It's just one of the outfits and um, the dress I wore for my birthday um, shoot last year. I mean, by the way, you guys, I realized that I've become a local celeb <laughs> without even planning. I know this outfit is very long, but please bear with me. I realized that I've become a local celeb. Like, I'll go somewhere, oh my god, so tea. I'll go somewhere, oh my god, so tea. And now I said, feeling some kind of way. Me that I didn't mind. Like, if I have a dress or outfit I like, I'll wear it 10 times, you know, wear it as much as possible. Now I'm very conscious. Like, once I take a picture or go out and wear the dress, I'm like, mm, should I really wear it again? But <laughs> I don't know. I kind of imagine how celebrities feel. Now, I'm not saying I'm a celeb or anything. I'm just saying that I started becoming more conscious of how I go out and what I wear, okay? And it's not a bad thing, okay? It's not necessarily a bad thing. I like looking put together. But what I'm even saying is that, like, imagine I've taken a picture with somebody because sometimes I see people and they're like, so let's take a selfie. I take a selfie and then, um, you know, that selfie, the clothes I'm wearing it like three or four times. I don't know if you get what I'm saying. Anyway, I'm repeating this dress. I think this is the third time I'm wearing it. I went for my birthday photo shoot. I went to church for another time. And another, I've worn it three times, so this will be the fourth time wearing it. Anyway, I'll show you the full outfit when I'm ready. Anyway, guys, I'll see you later. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I feel like I've said that a lot of times in this vlog. Subscribe and share, okay? Bye. <laughs> Angani ma, Angani ma, eh. Oh, my sweet girl.